Alzheimer's disease is a devastating condition that gradually erodes memory and independence, affecting millions worldwide. At its core lies amyloid beta, a protein that clumps together in the brain, triggering nerve cell damage and cognitive decline. The question is, can lecanemab, an innovative antibody treatment designed to target and clear toxic amyloid beta clumps, reduce cognitive decline in early Alzheimer's disease? The study. This is what a group of researchers from Yale School of Medicine and collaborating institutions investigated in their Phase 3 clinical trial titled, Lecanemab in Early Alzheimer's Disease, published in the New England Journal of Medicine, in January 2023. The approach. They conducted an 18-month, Phase 3 clinical trial with nearly 1,800 participants aged 50 to 90 affected by early Alzheimer's. Half received lecanemab every two weeks, while the other half received a placebo. They tracked changes in cognition, function, and amyloid levels in the brain. What they found is. Number 1. Lecanemab reduced cognitive decline by 27% compared to placebo as measured by the clinical dementia rating sum of boxes. Number 2. Brain scans revealed a 70% reduction in amyloid levels in those treated with lecanemab. Number 3. Patients on lecanemab retained more daily living abilities, scoring two points higher on a functional scale. Number 4. Adverse events included brain imaging abnormalities, 12.6%, and infusion reactions, 26%, were mostly mild and manageable. The impact. This study offers hope for slowing Alzheimer's progression by targeting its biological roots. While lecanemab isn't a cure, it represents a major step forward. Ongoing trials will provide more insights into long-term benefits and risks. To learn more, Click the QR code to access the full study.